on youtube my god it is so wet right now we've had days and days and days of rain everywhere is flooded here in australia all the east coast even down as far on the on the southern corners of, of australia where victoria meets new south wales is set to get absolutely drenched over the next 24 hours we've had literally days and days of this heavy rain that's just been flooding absolutely everything all the canals are full they're all brown everything like that uh, there's no go in the ocean because the ocean's absolutely massive because of the the storms that have created the the huge swells so there's no fishing out there there's there's basically nothing going on what i thought i'd do today is i noticed when i was driving the kids to school that one of the spillways had started spilling over it was actually a few days ago it started spilling over but there's more water running over now so i thought it might be a good opportunity to throw some surface lures throw some soft prawns and maybe some deep divers and see if there's any of those big predatory fish that like to sit up and eat all the bait that comes over over the top now because the the spillway has been going for a few days maybe there's no fish there maybe it's too fresh I'm not 100% sure but um, we're gonna try it out and see we might get lucky I know we are heading back out out to sea on Saturday so the weather's meant to clear up later on this week and then we're heading back outside so we'll be we'll be getting some good ocean fishing around then I'm expecting it to be pretty good because of all the rain and all the food that's running out of the the entrance at the at the Gold Coast so Let's go and have a look at what we've got. I'll show you how high the floodwaters is and how brown it is, and we'll throw a few lures and see if we get lucky. the whirlpool's going on. It's just mental. I've never seen it like this before. I'm going to have to be super careful. I was going to get up on this wall just here, but uh, it looks a bit too slippery and there's no way I want to fall into that. So I'm going to go over here on these rocks where I've got a good footing. I'm going to stay well back and see what we get. I didn't realise it was so violent, but uh, I've never seen it like that before. That's hectic. It's actually whirlpools. All right, guys, so I've decided to pull the pin. Uh, it was only short, I only gave it a short amount of time, but the water's moving too fast for the surface lures and also too for the, um, you know, for the rubber prawns and, and that sort of thing. So I thought I'm starting to get a bit creeped out by the whirlpool and the water's rising really, really hard. It's already risen 200 mils since we were here. So I thought we might pull the pin and quit while we're ahead. Uh, if you like the videos, you want to see more coming, make sure you like and subscribe. Uh, let us know when you subscribe, we'll message you right back, letting know we've seen you've subscribed. 
But for now, I'll see you next Saturday when we get out on the ocean and see if we can get into some big fish. See you then.